In this video, we will build a T-16 Skyhopper, fly a cow home from the Frostlands, build version 3 of the cow catcher, and check out the new farm village. Before we get started, I will give away the new Anarchy Acres bundle if we can hit 100 likes on this video to someone who posts a comment. Hit that like button. This airship has excellent handling and is really fast. Let's get into a quick build tutorial. I put the balloons on top for this build because I forgot to put the tyres on the bottom. Put the tyres on the bottom before removing the jack. I've built a lot of airships that look good but don't fly well. This one is incredible to fly and easy to build. I definitely recommend it. I wanted to test how easy it was to fly an animal home on my trusty vehicle. It turns out that it's pretty easy. Just lure a cow close to the airship and fish him on, then quickly take off. It turns out that they won't jump off an airborne ship. I flew a really long way back to my new farm village. He stayed on the whole way. And that is how Cooper came to be at my new farm village. Welcome, Cooper. I have built and rebuilt the cow catcher many times trying to improve it. This is the latest and easiest to build version. Tires are three ticks up from when it's red. If you haven't already and you made it this far, please hit the like button. I really appreciate it. The Anarchy Loft Barn lights up at night without any light sources. The fresh and dried hay bale stacks look the same when selecting. However, they are different when placed. They are a good way to store extra wheat. The other builds don't have the same automatic lighting. I needed to add lights. I will continue building out my farm while we wait for the Star Wars update on May 3rd. If you have watched to the end of the video and leave a comment that contains T16 in it, I will choose one of you for a special gift on May 3rd. As always, thanks for watching.